If you're looking to boost your FPS in CS2 and improve overall performance, in this video I'll walk you through key optimizations, from setting up performance monitoring to tweaking system settings for better CPU, RAM, and GPU efficiency. Whether you're experiencing lag, frame drops, or slow loading times, these steps will help you achieve the smoothest gameplay possible. Let's dive into the ultimate CS2 FPS boost. Gear Up Booster is a best tool to reduce your ping while playing games. It works with both wired and wireless connections. Download it for free from my description and enjoy smoother gameplay with lower ping. Step 1. Setting up a performance monitor to improve CPU performance. To make your CPU work better while gaming, we will set up a tool that tracks its performance in real time. Start by clicking the Windows search bar, type performance, and select performance monitor from the results. When the monitor opens, look at the left sidebar, find data collector sets, and double click to expand it. Next, click on user defined, then right click inside this section and choose new, followed by data collector set. A window will pop up asking for a name, type CS2 CPU boost in the field. After that, select create manually and click next. On the next screen, you will see different options. Check the box for performance counter, then click next. Now it's time to add a performance counter. Click add, and a new window will appear with multiple categories. Select processor from the list. Below that, you will see available instances. Choose the highest number listed for your system. For example, if the highest number is seven, select it. After selecting, click next, then finish to complete this step. At this point, you should see CS2 CPU boost in the list, but it will be stopped. To activate it, right click on CS2 CPU boost and select start. Once it starts running, you can close the window and the performance monitor will continue working in the background, helping your CPU perform better while gaming. Step two. Applying registry tweaks for better performance. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. In this step, you will make some registry tweaks to improve performance in CS2. These tweaks are small changes to Windows settings that help your computer run the game more efficiently. Even though this guide is for CS2, similar tweaks can also improve games like Fortnite by helping the system manage hardware and system resources better. If you're dealing with lag, slow loading times, or frame drops, applying these tweaks can make a noticeable difference in gameplay smoothness and FPS performance. Step 3. Enhancing RAM performance with registry tweak. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. In this step, you will optimize your RAM settings to improve your PC's overall performance. Start by going to the RAM Tweaks section and selecting the file that corresponds to the amount of RAM your PC has. Once you find the correct file, double-click it to apply the tweak. A prompt will appear asking for confirmation. Click Yes and then select OK to finalize the changes. This tweak will adjust your system's registry settings to make better use of your RAM, resulting in a noticeable performance boost for your PC, especially when running demanding applications or games. Step 4. Improving CPU Performance By Unparking CPU Cores you can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. Your CPU has multiple cores, but some of them may be parked, inactive, to save power, which can lower performance, especially during gaming or heavy tasks. To unlock the full potential of your CPU, you need to unpark these cores. Start by downloading and installing the Unpark CPU application. Once the installation is complete, right-click on the application and choose Run as Administrator to grant it full system access. When the program opens, it will display the status of your CPU cores, showing which ones are active and which are parked. To activate all cores, simply click the Unpark button. This will ensure that your CPU operates at its full power, leading to a noticeable boost in performance and smoother gameplay. Step 5. Boosting CPU performance by optimizing GPU priority. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. To enhance your CPU performance and improve the stability of your hardware, you need to optimize your GPU priority using the MSI Utility. Start by downloading and opening the MSI Utility tool to access its main interface. Once the program is open, find your GPU model in the list. Since the goal is to reduce lag and improve performance, check the MSI box next to your GPU model and set the interrupt priority to high. Next, locate your integrated GPU, such as Intel, in the same list. Again, check the MSI box next to it and set the priority to high. After making these adjustments, click Apply to save the settings, then close the MSI utility. In this step, I'm going to show you the best tool to get stable ping while gaming. So first, download the Gear Up Booster tool from the official website using the link in the description. After downloading, install it on your PC. Once installed, you'll see the Gear Up Booster interface. The first thing you'll need to do is log in with your Facebook or Google account. On the Home tab, you'll find all the games installed on your PC. 
If you go to the Games tab, you can browse thousands of games available for optimization. To optimize your network and FPS, return to the Home tab and select the game you want to boost. For example, I'll select Fortnite. Click the Boost button and the tool will begin optimizing the game. It will automatically find the best server for you. Next, you'll need to choose your server region. Select the nearest server for the best connection. In my case, the Middle East server works best. After selecting the server, close the window. Now go to the end tab where you'll see a list of servers available in the Middle East. Choose the nearest one or let gear up automatically pick the best server for you. I recommend setting it to automatic for the best results. Finally close the window and launch your game using gear up booster. This will help you optimize Fortnite or any other game for lower ping and higher FPS. Step 6. Improve CPU performance using Throttle Stop. You can get all the files I use in the pack from my official website. I've provided the link in the description. To further boost your CPU's performance, you need to use a tool called Throttle Stop. Start by opening the Tools folder on your computer and navigating to the Throttle Stop folder. Then run the Throttle Stop application. Once the application opens, you will see different power plans including performance, game, internet, and battery mode. For the best gaming experience, select the game power plan and check the high performance box. Among all available power plans, always choose high performance for the best results. Next, locate the settings labeled Clock Mode, Set Multiplier, and Speed Shift settings. Do not change any values here. Instead, simply click on Disable Turbo to prevent your CPU from overheating unnecessarily. After that, click the Turn On button and then save your changes. Finally, make sure to keep Throttle Stop running in the background at all times. Optimizing GPU Settings in the Control Panel In this step, you will optimize your GPU settings through the Control Panel to improve performance. These settings are mostly the same for all users. If you have an NVIDIA GPU, right-click on your desktop and open the NVIDIA control panel. Unfortunately, if you have an AMD GPU, you will need to follow a different process, which is not covered in this guide. For NVIDIA users, start by going to the Adjust Image Settings with Preview section. Select the option Use the Advanced 3D Settings and click on Take Me There to proceed. Now, adjust key settings for better performance. Find Power Management Mode and set it to Prefer Maximum Performance from the drop-down menu. This ensures that your GPU runs at its highest performance level at all times. Next, locate texture filtering quality and set it to high performance to further optimize your GPU. Once you have made these changes, apply the settings in your NVIDIA control panel. If you are using an AMD GPU, follow the equivalent steps in the AMD control panel to complete the optimization. Step 8. Disabling startup applications for faster boot and smoother performance. In this final step, you will learn how to disable startup applications to improve your system's performance. To prevent this, open Task Manager by pressing Ctrl plus Shift plus ESC on your keyboard. Once Task Manager is open, go to the Startup tab. Here you will see a list of applications that launch when your computer starts. Go through the list and disable any unnecessary startup applications by right-clicking on them and selecting Disable. This process will reduce boot time, free up system resources, and minimize background processes, leading to a faster and more efficient system. After making these changes, restart your computer to apply the optimizations. By following these steps, you can significantly enhance your PC's performance for a smoother and more responsive gaming experience. Keep your system optimized and enjoy lag-free gameplay.